And we were Millennium Land of Phase 1 um, in 80, 1989? 98. 98. Yeah, 98, my correction. 98, I birthed my first Millennium Madness drill team okay. in Richmond, California. You know what? These kids are so talented. You can't help but to love them and, and treat them with open arms because the talent that they present when they come in um, is something I can work with. Um, take it to another level and put my step on it because I've seen so much talent here in Memphis City, see within the youth. And then not only that, so many things has been taken away from them with all the talent. I decided, well, let me start something so I can present these young kids in another genre instead of seeing everything out here that's so negative. You know what? That's hard to do because all of them is uh, awesome dancers. But I have to give it to my captains for one that's why they're captains, um, which is... Um, Jessica Allen, Kyle Walker, Brandy, and um, what was my other? Uh, and JoJo. Kevin's my co-captain. He just moved out here from Richmond, California. And with his family also, they moved here to Memphis, Tennessee. And now we come, come, we came together. And he's now my um, assistant coach. Well, it's based on the same as I have here in Memphis, Tennessee. It's a fancy drill team. Um, youth of ages between 7 to 18 years of age. Um, we had like a few drummers um, back then because it's hard to find drummers in Richmond, California that's consistent and dedicated to the team. But when we're just like here, the fancy drill team, there is molding them into something. There's just so much they have to offer, like I said before. Um, I just take what they have and I perfect it. And um, what comes out of it is what you feel before perfection. I could say five to six hours. Now the summer's in six hours. Six Monday through Friday. Every day? Every day. I have been to New Orleans, um, Florida, Peretta, Italy, out the country, um, Las Vegas, Oakland, California, um, Kansas City, Houston, Texas. I could say Peretta, Italy because none of us have ever been out the country. And to get an all expense paid trip, to do what we like to do and to perform for a wedding, uh, oldest wedding, um, and to grace the stage of other celebrities, that was awesome and the bond was great. First of all, Millennium Mad is, is just something that I feel like God gave me as my calling. This is my calling. And um, to, be able to work around kids that are acceptance of me is a blessing and it makes helps me grow also because sometimes I feel like I'm a parent instead of just a director because a lot of times they come to me and confide in me more than they will do with their parents. So Millennium Madness is more than just a team, it's a family. Oh, competition is hectic. I mean, you, you start like 8 in the morning, it doesn't end sometimes till 10 at night because they have different categories. They have military, fancy position, and fancy um, trick category. And we're considered a fancy, but they have um, K-6, through 10-12 through 12 categories, then the drum competition. So competition is like real time consuming. You have to really be patient. I have to say, IRS from Dayton, Ohio. Yeah, they give me a ride. You know, I'm just a traveler. I like to kick my kids in the road and I'm, I'm not scared to compete and they're not. Um, so there's really nowhere we go to pick scariness. We just like to bring our A game. But um, California is where the drill teams are born and raised other than Dayton, Ohio or the Ohio area, state of Ohio. But California has some of the hardest core drill teams I've ever seen.